All right, this was actually a basic fundamental of Django. We are yet to create advanced applications. For that, we need more practice. In this course, we will be building three projects. One of them is this simple employee directory website to understand the basics. The complexity level of this project is very low. The next project we are building is the to-do app, which will be little more complex than the one that we built right now. Building to-do app is the best way to learn any new technology because we'll be working with the data and make a couple of CRUD operations. The CRUD is very important to understand the ins and outs of software applications. And then we are also going to build the blog application. See, this blog application is going to be a really good project. We'll do hands-on practice by building necessary features a website should have, such as login registrations, permissions, authors, categories, and block creations and all that. You will get to explore a lot of topics and tricks in this project. With that said, I currently have multiple on-demand Django courses with medium and high complexity levels where I build the real software applications. I'm not recommending you to buy those courses right now because we are just starting with the basics. You need a little more practical knowledge on Django before you get there. That's why we are preparing ourselves to build the big applications. They are pretty advanced level uh, Django projects. Your resume will attract the employers if you have those projects in your portfolio or GitHub. You know what the software development industry is becoming so much competitive that even the experienced software developer wants to get a job as a fresher because he just needs the opportunity. In this competitive world, if you go as a fresher without any projects in your portfolio, then more likely you will end up not getting the call back from the employer. That's the reason I built the advanced projects using Django so that even the freshers can have the real experience about building the real software applications. That's when you stand out from the crowd. From the next section, we will build to-do app and learn more about CRUD operations.